going on YouTube. Advertise Crush back with y'all once again. And uh wanna talk about something with you guys real quick. This. This is my most recent Game Informer magazine. Now, let's see, uh, Mario ad, um, just, um, Western Digital ad, um, Killer is Dead ad, um, it's, uh, blah, blah, uh, Wonderful 101 ad for the Wii U. Blah, um, blah, 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 blah. I'm I'm reading this, this right here, and this the, the sad part about it is, one would hope that in the age of digital newspapers, digital magazines, and and all this, that they would put more effort into this. I I, I hope they would. Now they're all like, well, we want to put you to the website, too. You know, if you're going to try to move people to the website, then move everybody. The reason why I say that is, because this right here, this month's Game Informer, doesn't cut the mustard. And it probably won't from here on out. Now... This does tie into a note about GameStop that I want to touch on. Mostly because a lot of where your money goes when you dish out that $15 is towards this, supposedly. It's not just the deal on the used games. But a lot of it's going to that, what, that magazine. Truth be told. Which, honestly, if you're paying that money per year to get that game informer that you can pretty much only really get at GameStop. You shouldn't really have to deal with a ton of ads. And the sad part about it is is that some of the articles in these game informers are good articles, but not all. Case in point. Mm -mm. Normally, when you're reading Game Informer, and they do a preview. That that game is at least three to four months away when they do a preview. It's a Saints Row 4. Saints Row 4 is coming out this week. I just got this on Friday, mind you. Um, Killzone Shadowfall, months away. Thief, months, if not a year away. The Bureau... XCOM Declassified comes out this Tuesday. Madden NFL 25 comes out in two weeks. Castle of Illusion, September the 3rd. I mean... How can, how can I honestly justify making the purchase to get a Game Informer every year when... Half of what I'm getting is out of date. Game Informer needs to get to pushing. Otherwise, Game Informer will no longer exist. Either in print form or, or online, mind you. Mostly because most people associate Game Informer with GameStop. And whatever they rate high is automatically associated with GameStop wanting to push that game. Sorry to be the bearer of news to many of you. It's like, oh, Game Informer is 100% neutral. They're all about great games. Don't kid yourself. The same thing goes on at IGN. Hate to be the bearer of news. And the same thing's probably happening with, like, GamePro and, of course, I mean... Xbox magazine, which is like the only one left now. But it's it's this type of this type of 
journalism that leads a lot of people to not want to work in the game industry. Sorry to say. And I find myself at the end of the year when they say, do you want to renew that power of rewards? I, I find myself at a crossroads because like, I, I kind of do, but on the same token, it's not worth getting a game in form every month. Kind of gotten to that point. Sad to say. So, my message to the people who run Game Informer, if you should ever see this, time to start ramping up your production or eliminate the print version altogether. Say, you know what, it's going to be a full on just a website like IGN and go, and go that route. Otherwise, you're going to sit there and hemorrhage more money and hemorrhage more money to the point of you're like, well, we can't justify keeping this place open anymore and you're going to just go on the pile of other companies other magazines that used to be pretty big but now sit on the the mountain of publications that unfortunately have gone bust so there's my thoughts on Game Informer disagree? agree? video response? Pop it down below. Also, hit me up on Twitter at Aphrodite's Crush, and also check out my t shirts on District Lines. Well, I want to thank everybody out there for watching, and y'all, have yourselves a good one. Peace out.